Hello, Iris Zero here. I hope you're all well. I'm good. Thank you very much for asking. So, I finally, finally, finally finished Metal Gear Solid 5. Um, it took me a while. I got it day one. It took me a while. Um, I got distracted because there were some days where I couldn't play. And, um, and there were other days where I just wanted to grind and do side missions. Um, and if you haven't read the title, first off, this will have spoilers. Uh, it's not really a review, it's just uh, stuff I really wanted. I really wish I had more um, characters from the previous uh, from the previous games. It was weird that it just had Liquid and not Solid Snake as well. Um, I, I would really, really love to have seen what was cut from the game. Because as the PC version showed, it was hacked. Uh, guys were able to get in and see some content from that. That would have been in it. There would have been an extra chapter. And I would love to have seen what they would have done. Apparently there was a skin textures for the boss. So I'd love to have seen what would have happened there. It's like, end it. Chapter 1 and 2, you have Phantom Boss. The Phantom Boss. And then chapter three would have been like the real boss and see what he would have gone through. That would have been awesome. Because, you know, we couldn't have Eva uh, scenes with scenes with the boss. You couldn't have scenes that, with that with the fake snake because they would have known, oh, you're not the real snake. Um, the tapes about like the truth, they were good, but it makes snake out to be a real prick. When Ocelot brings up the clones, Liquid and Solid Snake, right away he says, I don't care, fuck them, they're not mine, they're not my kids, they're just fucking test tube experiments. And even, like, because in MGS4 he always said, you know, I never saw you as a son, but I respected you as a man. He didn't even, he wasn't even like that in, um, in, uh, if you listen to the tapes with Ocelot. So Ocelot kind of confirming again he is a good guy, I think. Um, he probably is a good guy in the series. Uh, loyal to the boss to the end. Um, so overall, great game. Very sad though that it's probably the last, or at least last one Kojima. It's going to be interesting to see what happens with, uh, with the new team, if Konami makes games ever again. But we'll see. And yeah, I'm done for today. Um, yeah, it's a quick review of Metal Gear Solid. I liked it. And, um, don't think I'll go back to it for a while. I uh, doubt they're going to release DLC for it, only with the uh, multiplayer. Uh, maybe I'll grind a bit more, uh, finish my base, see what happens there. Well, until next time, I, uh, I guess I'll finish up. Uh, until next time, 